the wall public market is in an area of Sacramento that has become very popular. And this is a great place, great location to have an exhibit of, like this because it gives people an opportunity to see probably there's a good chance in this area that they'll recognize some of the pictures on the wall that they've seen them, but they've just never thought of these, the people they've seen as they've been depicted in the imagery. Hi, my name is Gail Filter. I'm a street photographer. I've been filming or shooting homeless people in Sacramento for the past five years. So this is my passion. This is what I like doing. I like street photography. I like um, getting out and meeting some of the people that you see um, in the photographs behind me who I've gotten to know over the years. And um, I think it's important that they be shown as I have depicted them in these photographs because it's much different than uh, a lot of people see them. For the most part here in Sacramento, the homeless are ignored. This exhibit is unique because all the photographs you see here, the street portraits, have been taken during the COVID-19 pandemic. So the, the pandemic has had an incredible impact on all of us, but for the homeless, it's had a, a particular impact in that um, they're exposed. Uh, many don't wear masks, many don't uh, use hand sanitizer. So my theory behind this is that I call it good trouble imagery, which um, John Lewis, the civil rights activist, said that, you know, we. Photography can serve as a means for me, through my imagery, to speak for others who might not be able to speak for themselves. If you spend any time at all on Sacramento streets and alleys, as I do, there's two things that become apparent, that you'll find a lot of homeless and a lot of art in Sacramento, um, Sacramento streets and alleys. So I like using the art that I find in Sacramento as backdrops for the homeless people that I photograph. And I like to hear what they have to say about the imagery or the murals that they're being shot in front of. So these two photos of different people were shot in front of Lynn Fei Fei's mural introspection in Midtown Sacramento. And you can see the dramatic of impact that the mural has when the a homeless person is put on, put in front of it, and it, it's moving. And, and the one thing that you'll notice in Sacramento is that many of these murals, you will never see them defaced, you'll never see them with graffiti on it because the, the homeless people, just like the rest of us, respect and, and appreciate the art that they, that they find in the, the alleys and the streets. This is a, an image of David. He's been homeless for about eight years. Um, and when I asked him what he, was, what, he was, what he was thinking about when he looked at the mural is that he was reflecting or introspecting about his homelessness. And um, he at one time had received supplemental social security and then he had lost it. But the one thing that you get is from no matter who you speak with about life on the streets is that it's really a struggle and that, um, you know, survival is not, is not a given. What I really like about this exhibit and this art show is the merging of Sacramento's art with the community and the homeless. When you really stop to think about it, we all count or nobody counts.